Big, big boys, big as boy. Shit, but I was getting complimented for once. You're saying, Ziggs? <laughs> yeah. Also, you should, uh... JT, I thought you watched watch, that watch video I sent you. Just put this in, like, in the background in one of your panels and shit. I'm gonna fucking... I'm gonna... <laughs> JT was getting complimented. <laughs> I had to come it in. It was a setup. It was all set up. I had to come in and ruin. <laughs> no, no, it was a no. setup. Zig planned it from the you start. Know what? You know what, Zig? What? I'll... Not this week. I'll do it. Fuck you. What? What's? Cool. What's been up? I don't believe it. 
Are you hi are you gonna hide something in your comic, JT? Yeah, apparently. We're gonna fucking do it. <laughs> JT, JT. Not this week. <laughs> JT, oh. hi hide hide a Skellamerick somewhere in the background. Like put him in a crowd or something. You know what? No, I'm gonna make. Can I make him a guest character for one fucking issue? Fucking sure. go for it. Go for it. <laughs> um. <laughs> I remember. Why are we? In, why are there ghosts in a robot factory? Oh, I mean, no. oh, oh god! They're on, the I'm they're the ghosts man. of all the fucking workers who died in the factory. <laughs> they blew, they you know, blew up. That makes sense. <laughs> they got caught oh, in the factory um, explosion and they blew up. Yeah. Oh god! You know, Nick, this is they do. To, this is normally in Halloween Town, so a skeleton would not be that far out of place. I yeah. know. Nick, I have a genuine question. What's your question? Do you want do you to be an in-universe celebrity in Halloween Town? Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> you know what? That'd be pretty fucking funny, yeah. Yeah, you're you're this like you're this universe's you're the Halloween Town equivalent of PewDiePie. Oh god. No, I didn't want to open with this at all. I thought we were gonna talk about something else, but hot damn. This is ironic. Just as I was fucking- this how, like, fucking Okage music was playing during the whole intro thing. Fucking now- now you're talking about me being the idiot- this universe is Pewdie- the Halloween universe is PewDiePie or whatever. Because- uh, Fucking- oh my god, I hate- I did not want to open with this at all. Because it's- it's stupid and terror- it's stupid! It very- it's very fucking stupid! <laughs> so, I don't know what this is. So-, so I'm, I'm so, all right, all right. Uh, well, well, you're you're well aware. You're well aware of my parents, right? Uh, yeah. yeah. Well, both of you are at this. Well, both of you are. I think I think everybody I think everybody's like very well aware of them because of like you know, talked about them a few times and whatnot. Uh -huh. But nah, like let let me. Oh God. You know what? You know. You know. I. You know. I'm gonna save this for a little bit. Anybody else? Anybody else of anything? How are you guys doing? Uh, I, I, I have a joke for you. What's your joke? <clears throat> hold on. Let me. Let me. Uh. Everyone, give him the floor. Give him the floor. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Let me. Let me pull it up. Need an opening act, Um. He's doing- he's like the Kermit doing the backflip with the V. Ziggs, Ziggs, do you yeah, need an opener? JT, warm up the crowd for me. Alright, hey, hey, what's going Welcome on? Welcome everybody, Very it's P-Pants the- Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, hey, hey, who, who here, uh... Who he's juggling- parents? He's juggling the Krabby Patties. Look at him. I'm spinning plates. Alright, fucking. Did I ever say on screen that what happened the day I got my plates? Did you? I, I don't know, but what happened was. I know right? I know you hid your plate sticks inside of like the half of a uh the half piece. of a cross trick. Which to be fair was secretly just being used as weapons. In case some in case some weirdo jumped you or some shit. Right, but um, either way, right? <laughs> wow, that was insta so, kill. What happened was, um, I got my, I got my, 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 you know, I learned how to do it in class, right? Really, yeah. I was really proud of myself, really happy with it. So, you know. Welcome to clown college. Uh, so I did take a clown class, and I was, and I am very happy of of, of it. I, I can still, I can kind of juggle. Um, I can kind of, I can get like, I can get a good couple reps in before it all goes flat. I think my, I don't know if my I think my record's nine. I need to get, I need to get back into practicing because it was it, juggling's fun. But either way, yeah. Um. But, I, but, you know, plates, plates was the part that I really, like, did good at and stuck with, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So I got my, so, you know, I got my own. And 
I'm opening the box and I'm, box and I'm like, oh, fuck yeah, plates are fixed. <laughs> and my dad's like, what, you get, you're into fucking fine china now? And I'm like, no. <laughs> <It's just spinning." laughs> I walk up to my room, and boom, right? <laughs> I hear him roll his eyes and sigh and goes, I thought I was done with this clown crap when I divorced your mother. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't respond because how the fuck would I? I don't know how I would respond to that. It, it all started when my mother took me to the circus. No, my mother's actually a clown. Yeah, I remember that part. <laughs> what are you the, the funny part is, what are you into? Fine China now? <laughs> oh my god. Your dad, uh, your dad just like no fucks given, man. Oh yeah, no, he does. He does not. <laughs> so, so, how's your comic coming? Um, how's your comic coming, son? I don't, you know, on God, don't think he's ever. I, I think if I asked him the name of any of the comics I've worked on, he wouldn't know. What the hell is what the hell is Halloween Town? Right here. Oh yeah, yeah, say the joke, say the joke. The crowd's warmed up. We're still the back. Alright, <clears throat> right, Zig, floor's yours. An 80-year-old couple are having we're having trouble remembering things. They went to the doctor and he told them that there's nothing wrong with them. You just have- they're just gonna have to write some shit down every now and then. Later that night, while watching TV, the old- the old man gets up to his- gets up from his chair, and his a wife asks him, Where are you going? He says, To the kitchen. You want anything? The wife says, Will you get me a bowl of ice cream? The, <laughs> the husband says, Sure. The wife later says, don't you think you should write that down so you can remember it? No, I can remember that. <laughs> well, I would also like some strawberries on top. You better write that one down too, because I know you'll forget that. <laughs> she says. The husband says, I can remember that. You want a bowl of ice cream with strawberries. <laughs> she, she, oh, she replies, well... I would also like whipped cream on top. And I know damn well that you will forget that, so you better write that down. The, the husband <laughs> angrily says, I don't need to write that down. I can remember it. You want a, a bowl of ice cream with strawberries and whipped cream on top. And then, af and then afterwards, he goes into the kitchen. About 20 minutes later, he returns to, to the kitchen and hands her a fucking plate of bacon and eggs. <laughs> she stares at him for, for a moment and says, Where's my fucking toast? <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. I get, I get the vibe. I got one. I got one. I got one. Okay. Right? Oh god, is this just gonna be... This is it gonna be long, drawn-out jokes, the episode, and I'm quite frank, this is what I need today. <laughs> Alright, you guys make me. Visit. You guys make me... Uh, you guys make me win sometimes, but I love you. Good. Alright. So this is a hospital, right? And it has a deal. For a hundred dollars, they'll cure anything. Can't cure it. They'll give you five hundred. Right? Yeah. So, the, um, so a man is like, oh, you know what, this is going to be easy. I'm going to pull fast from the doctor, right? Mm hmm He walks up to the doctor. Hey, uh, I can't taste anything. The doctor goes, nope. Nurse, can you bring me the vial in 5S? The nurse <laughs> goes, brings back, a, brings back a, a small vial, right? And he goes, all right, drink this to be cured. So the man shrugs, takes a sip. He spits it out. Out. You just fed me vinegar. Ah, so you can taste again. That'll be a hundred dollars. I have one more. I have one more. Wait, hold on. It's not. It's not. Wait, wait. It's not. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. My bad. 
This is on the level of Hullabaloo and Howdy Do, Musty Prawns and Timbuktu. Yell right, see bye right, so... and hippity poo. Kick him in the dishpan. Woo woo woo. Next day, next day, right? Next day. He thinks of a new scheme to pull one over. He goes, Doc, my memory is shot. I think I have amnesia. I can't remember anything. The, the doctor go, oh, stands in, nods, and goes, <laughs> I got the cure. Nurse, bring me the vial from 5S. The man goes, wait, no, that's vinegar. The, the doctor goes, ah, so you remember. All right. <laughs> All right, that'll be $100. <laughs> All right. Silly rabbit tricks are for kids. <laughs> That's what it's fucking. So the man, so the man, day, one day after, right? Goes, all right, I got, goes, I got, I got it. Hey guys, I got this. All right, doctor, my eyesight's completely shot. I can't see anything. The doctor standing there, pauses, right? He goes, all right. You know, I don't think I can cure that one. Here you go, and he hands him. Only one hundred dollars. The man, lo the man looks at it and goes, "Wait a minute, is this the, isn't this the hundred dollars I gave you?" The doctor goes, "Ah, so you can see again. That'll be one hundred dollars." <laughs> <laughs> I hate this. That's, that's the joke. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it all. I yeah 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 yeah. I fucking can't do this. I can't take this shit, man. Oh, <laughs> uh, I 100% needed this. <laughs> you sound yeah. repressed. JT, are you are JT, are you a repressed clown right now? Okay, one somewhat. <laughs> Two, I felt I felt like I was going to pass out. Yeah, it's true. Um, earlier. The guy was contemplating just being like, "Hey, Nick, I can't." Why what happened? I, I drank some water. I I put some food in my in my tummy. I feel better now and just like no thinky shit is exactly what I need anymore. <laughs> no thinky? I don't want to think. Brain power? Too much. <laughs> I can't. Don't have it. Can't afford it. <laughs> Brain power? Too much. Can't think. <laughs> oh. no, no, bra no brain power for me, thank you. <laughs> this is fucking gold. This is fucking rich. You're actually not putting any thought into the sentences. It's great. <laughs> Look, man. I've done it. I've done my job. I've made the funnies happen. <laughs> what more? What more do you need? You sound like you're dying. Is everything okay? Yes, I'm fine. Uh, again, I feel really fucking lightheaded and headed like. Not even, not even 20 minutes ago. <laughs> do you, do you like, did you like that minifigure? Well, he's gonna be with you for... <laughs> yeah, you wanna give some context to that real quick? <laughs> yeah. So, so I, 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 made, I made them, I made these, I made these guys think that I swallowed a fucking Lego minifigure. An ultra hammer. To be fair, we like, okay, well, Johnny, Johnny was fully convinced. I was like, he's fucking with us. Cause so he's, he's, he, he, <laughs> the, he, Eugene was fully convinced cause he, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, he, 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 he's easily convinced by that. Yep. I swallowed the, uh... The... Any, anyway, no, but it was, like, fucking whatever. Mm -hmm. Oh, God. But, yeah, no, I, I... I'm fine. I didn't do stupid. I didn't fucking... <laughs> he didn't swallow... They didn't find the cum sock. He didn't swallow the minifigure. <laughs> the what? <laughs> didn't swallow the minifigure that... Even though, like, they were all, like... <laughs> and you were like, oh, I hope, did you like that minifigure? I'm like, what? Hmm. Oh, it's the first yeah. fucking boss of this thing. Yeah. It's, it's, clock. <laughs> it's a bell, it's two bells and a clock, and they're all like different characters. Alright, I call, I call bell on the right. So not all this right. one. 
others one. It's Mario! It's Mario. How did they How did get, get here? here? That's what I said. It's a fucking clock. We better do something. <sighs> this is one of the many boss fights we're gonna be facing off against this shit. Oh yeah. Oh Fun god, time, baby. It's not even really a gauntlet. It's like we got like we got like boss level boss level boss level boss level boss, and then it's just yeah. like there's like forty of them here. Like, I, I, I like that they had a lot of ideas, but, you know, I, uh, but yeah, so, 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 yeah, GT, you, you almost died, uh, Zig, how are you doing? Um, pretty good, um, I had a pretty productive day at work and whatnot, so, you know, I'm hanging in there, excuse me, uh, I'm hanging in there. Time is marching on. Speaking of which, I got a, I got a job. Nice. Wait, really? Uh, yeah. I am a uh, I am a graphic designer. Oh, congrats! Ooh. Thank you. What do you graphic design? Oh, uh, right now I'm working on a. Uh, now I'm making a T-shirt. Um, oh, I made nice. some logos for a company. Cool. Oh. Oh. Um, what do you wait? Like, what do you mean? Like, are you like freelance or like? What? I'm like, I'm kind of freelance, kind of working for one company right now. Um, I'm trying. I don't know how much I'm directly allowed to. Say. I'm sure I'm. I don't know exactly how much I'm allowed to say. Like, kind of no, but like, no, but like, NBA. when you say no, like when you're working, are you like licensed under a company to like do this stuff, or like as in you're working for? I'm working directly for a company that does that does like graphic design. Yeah, yeah. Like right now, I'm designing a uh, shirt for them because they have their they have their own logo. They basically just told me, that, "Hey, take this logo and then put a dragon on it." All right, bitchin'. Well then, nice. <laughs> I'm still searching. You'll I'm, find something. I know. You got it. <laughs> nah, look, look. Uh, it's it's whatever. I, I I honestly, you wanna know my whole you wanna know my whole stake in it? What? Zero like all right, zero zero fucks given. If no if nobody fucking hires me, it's like well fuck you too anyway. You know what I mean? Yeah, I like, like hey fucking you you fuckers are missing out. Not not me. Yeah, it's like I I, I thought I thought that there was like a job crisis going on. You know, so. I mean, there no, there is. It's just no one's hiring. Not no one, you know. Yeah. They turned, they turned Mallow into a scarecrow. Hmm. And he was already a fucking mushroom. Man, if I only <laughs> had a brain. <laughs> well, at least I can do magic. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh god. But I anyway. Thought, I thought the scarecrow from um. What was the scarecrow? I thought. Was, was it? He needed a brain? Yeah. I thought it was hard, was or was that the robot? That was the Tin Man. That's what it meant, he had the Tin Man. I'm, I'm no, trying to... Was a bitch. So, you know what the, you know what the thing is? I'm trying, I'm, I'm trying to get back into the swing of shit, you know? Yeah. Today I fixed up my, today I fixed up my, uh, PS2 games, and it wasn't that big of a mess, though. I thought it was oh, gonna take up a lot more time. So I, I, I popped in and I threw on Okage Shadow King because fuck it, I can, you know? Right. And, uh. You played more of it today than I <laughs> Well, you were fatigued, man. Yeah, that's why I wanted to, and then it was just like, oh, I'm dying. Yay. <laughs> you see the. <laughs> You look out the window, you see the freaking the, the, you see the corridor of light. I'm just looking- no. 
Too many people owe me money, I can't die yet. <laughs> ay, 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 ay. I have a, I have a friend of mine. Um, Too many people owe me money. You you'd be surprised. It's upsetting how many people owe me money. Um I have a friend, right? And there goes Mario! Oh well, that's not good. Um, I have a friend. He really wanted to play like his his disc copy of one of his favorite games, like got scratched and broke on him, right? Oh. Yeah. So I was like, ah, oh, you know what? You're, you're, the, like, the DLC for this game you've been waiting for it comes out fucking tomorrow. I'll just buy the digital copy. And he's like, oh, you can do it for me, thanks. And, and you know, I. I <laughs> Oh yeah, all right. And I know the guy. He, he like he's a good friend of mine. So, oh you know, I was like, all right, you know, just owe me, just owe, owe me X amount. I'll gladly right. pay you Tuesday for a hamburger. <laughs> you know what? I'll wait. I'm gonna, I'm gonna come back to that because there's one thing I have, one thing I've always questioned about that. But either way, right? <laughs> okay. So one day he called me. He was like, hey, I wanted to catch up with you. First of all. Remember the, remember the game you bought me that I, that I had to pay you back for? And I go, yeah. And he goes, he just stands there, sits in silence for a second, and he goes, I don't have your money. I just wanted to make, I just wanted to r remind us. And I'm like, <laughs> okay, so you, so you, 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 you called me to tell me I, you don't have my money. <laughs> oh, God. And he's like, Yep. Where's the money? Where's the money? I, I wasn't even. I'm not. I wasn't like trying to grill him for it. Are you? Are you? Are you gonna cane him? Are you gonna cane him, JT? Easily could. <laughs> oh God, JT, no! It's not worth it. I disagree. Bonk. You just hit him with a fucking cane. Canes are cool as weapons. You know what the thing is, I, I could say this at least though, like, just being, just not, like, just being on a perpetual job search for, like, the longest time, mm -hmm. it uh, it just has been letting me, like, uh, like, I'm, I'm trying to, like, you know what the thing is, I'm trying to not be depressed about it, but, like, people, but, like, people make me depressed about it. Because they don't fucking, because they keep fucking pestering you and shit, I know, I know yeah. Yeah, like, like, the, like, it never feels like it's good enough, no matter what, like, progress you're trying exactly! to make. Exactly! Exactly! You like, hit- uh, The reason why I have my current job is because my dad was basically like, alright, you're doing something over the summer, and I'm like, I just busted my ass off for finals. Can you, can you give me, like, a, a, a minute? No! Yeah. Which, you know what, hey, if, if, if I, if, uh, I can get paid, paid enough doing this, get me the fuck out of here. Seriously, I'd love to make a living off of fucking sitting at a desk for a couple hours. Drawing hours stuff. A day and, and, yeah, which to be fair, don't be illustrator, bitch of an app to use, but damn is it effective. But yeah, uh, so... Talk about. God, I guess this is a good segue into what I wanted to. I guess this is a good segue into the thing I wanted to avoid for a while, but fuck it. Um, so mm -hmm. there there was a streamer I think I, there was a streamer I think was in the news recently or something. Ooh, that's already a bad sign. Because yeah. my dad my dad was talking about it because he knows I do this shit right. Right. And that streamer is Pokimane. Right? I know. We, so, I, I, yeah. I tried so hard to avoid the conversation. Because I don't care. Because it had to do with politics. I don't care about Pokimane. I made, I made, like, I don't even know who she is. I'm like, I don't know who she is. I only, like, she's, if she's in the news, that means she's, like, a big streamer. And I don't really watch those people. I only watch, like, one. And that's because, like... If you type in www.fecalfunny.com, it takes you to his Twitch page. Yeah. And that, that streamer is uh, Varg Skeletor Joel and whatnot. So, 
A anyway, the point is, is that like I tried so hard to not. <laughs> I tried so hard to. So so he was asking me like, oh, like why why like why aren't you in like the news about this stuff or whatever? And I'm like, because I don't I I don't like you know do the popular thing. I don't want to be like millions of subscribers big really. Um, cause it kind of sucks and it's not fun event. You know, it gets not fun cause there's always eyes on you. I frankly don't want to be in the news, which I find that ironic that you <laughs> make me the PewDiePie of the thing. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> no, but in that context, I find it funny in regular context, in real world context. My, my hair right now is a little crazy. My hair right now is a little crazy. Just thinking about it makes my hair fucking go crazier. Anyway, so my, my dad said that I'm not a provocateur and that's what get you like millions of people and would get me on the news and like make me money or whatever. And I'm like, okay. I, you know what I mean? I'm just like, you know, I'm just like, I just thought, I just thought of it like, you know, this would be fucking funny to like, be, like basically kick the hornet's nest and whatnot. So it was like, okay. He's like, like, let me, he's like, let me write you something so you could talk about it on stream and i'm like I, I like through gritted teeth i was like i was trying to not smile about this because i'm like this is so freaking stupid is so, he like trying to get you canceled he's trying to make me a provocateur so i so i'm like all right whatever so I said, you know what, kick your horn says, I'm trying to hide my smile, because he's doing it. So he goes searching on Twitter, and he basically, like, he he writes one of his tweets. He writes one of his tweets on this paper, and I have the paper right next to me. Oh. I'm gonna read it. I'm gonna read my dad's words, because he wants me. Wait, 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 before you read it, what if he read this and somehow it does make you famous? I don't fucking know. I don't fucking care. Cause I, I, I only talk about poli. All right, all right. You, all right. You want to hear? You want to hear the politic of the week? Nah. You, you just want? No, no, no. Let me, let me just say one politic of the week. Let me just say one politic of the week here. My, my, my personal. We get one politic of the week, and this is my personal point of view here. The fact that the Supreme Court overturned Roe v. Wade is fucking stupid. They deserve to have a Trevor. They deserve to have a pre like an army of pregnant women. Aim a trebuchet at him. Anyway, um... That's a cold take. Cold take? A very cold take. But this is for... Yeah, this is a <laughs> take. All I said was, hey, you want your politic of the week? There you go. Uh, I'm not... I'm not a righty. I'm not a righty. Like, if it's not immediately... If it's not immediately, what should we call it? I'm not a righty. It's not immediately apparent. I'm not a righty. So, anyway, while well, we battle these clones of fucking the Axum Rangers here. I mean, to be fair, m like, we're in New York. We're probably one of the le most left leaning states. You can vote whatever, and <laughs> you can vote whatever, and it'll still be blue here. Yeah, exactly. I and voted for I voted for fucking I voted for a third party candidate and I and the smart thing to do. The smart thing to do if you want to scare both parties. But anyway, anyway, look, look. I vote I vote <laughs> I voted for Joe Jorgensen because Soto Chino Sana made Jojo. I did not care with the last election. I'm just like Whatever. Memes. A anyway, the point is... I don't remember who I fucking voted for. He had a funny name. <laughs> anyway, I the... Know who you're talking about. Anyway, the point is, that was the sole... This is the sole politic of the night. Just because I want to read what my dad wrote about... <laughs> for my, what my dad wrote for my stream. Because he, he heard about Pokimane on some fucking news network. On some fucking conservative news network somewhere. What did Pokemon even do? It had to do with the Roe v. Wade thing. Oh, alright. So, uh, like, it had to do with the Roe v. Wade thing. I mean, you know, like, people like, people say stupid shit about everything. It's like, oh, yeah. whatever. So, like I like I said, I don't care about Pokemon. I don't watch Pokemon. I'm just, I'm just, it just has to do with context with what I was trying to avoid for the longest time. And I'm just like, fuck it, because 
everything just kind of like led back into it. So, this is what my dad wrote. This like white sheet of computer paper here. Quote. Um, strange. Hold on. I, I, let me try to do a strange but true. I can't do my dad's voice. Strange but true. Hold on. Hold on. What's it? Damn it. Yeah, you have, you got, uh, do you have to sound like a bit like this or some shit? I don't know. I, I, I was trying to, I just said fucking, I was either going to make it like a Nixon voice or a freaking like, uh, what's his face? Oh, Nick. I feel, like, I, feel like, I feel like Nixon works good here. Strange but true. Oh! A beloved subway busker who entertained folks by playing his Saxon. He spelled Bustin, B-U-S-T apostrophe N. Some dance moves was arrested by Mayor Adams Elite NYP Subway Crime Unit. They jostled the entertainer known as, AKA for some reason, Dancing His Happiness. Tossing him to the ground as he actually cried in protest. After the be after the after the bust, Mayor Adams proclaimed in a statement to the NY media, "Quote unquote, we must restore law and." My dad writes weird. It looks like an L, but it, it, it guess it's an L, but it, it wrote it like an H. Ha! In order. In the subway, <laughs> this statement, a bit inexplicable, as violence in the city rampant, commuters being stabbed, shot, or pushed by blah 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 miscreants. Blah blah blah, blah 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 blah. I am not a crook, but Mr. Dancing is happiness is a top priority in Mayor Adams' war on crime. L M F A O. Did he really write LMFAO? He wrote right LMF. I, I will take a picture. I don't know if I'll post it to the Discord, but I'll send it to you guys. Oh. He wrote LMFAO and he, he meticulous. You need this. You need this. I'm America. <laughs> can you, can you do, do me uh, 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 a whole new solid? Is it? Maybe a JT? If you, well, here's, here's the solid I need you to do. Can I, if, if you ever get like, I'm um, like super mega big, right? Yeah. If you ever get like, like fucking, shut the fuck up, watch. <laughs> if you ever get like, <laughs> up, like fucking top tier, actually like Pokemon up there, right? I'd cry. I want you to have a, a hold, okay, hold on. Fair, but let me finish. I want you to have a room in your house. Like, that's just in that room. I want that piece of paper fucking framed and hung up from the wall. <laughs> <laughs> I, I just need that in my like this this piece of paper that your dad made for you. Shrine. He he. My my favorite part my favorite part about this though is that like. <laughs> The Bustin' with the apostrophe. <laughs> He's trying to be hip with the kids! Oh. There's a lot, there's a lot, lot, lot wrong. There's a lot, a lot wrong. J like, the funniest part, too, is how meticulous he spelled out L-M-F-A-O. Like, there's a space between every letter. This is, this is literally a tweet my dad would write. I'm not kidding. I mean, he did physically write it. He fi yeah, he fi <laughs> You know what the worst part was? Uh, he uh, uh, Merrick, I'm just gonna say this right now. No offense to like you or your dad or anything. None taken. This, sound this sounds like a schizo post. Oh! You know what? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that is true. Very true. I'm sorry. No, no, you don't have to be. You don't have to be. 
I, I, I told me, I told okay, okay. nothing, nothing's good enough, so I, I have to be a quote unquote provocateur for the, uh, for the, uh, whatchamacallit or whatever. Like, so, do you want me, do you want me to be your provocative edge character on the stream? And theme? Like, is that like, like I say really bullshit ass radical sentences? No. And then you're just like, and then you're just like, well, hang on. <laughs> Or, um, I don't know about that one. And then, no. And then, digs, and then uh, like, like, I got it. We'll take, here's a, here's a dry run, right? You ready? <laughs> Man, I don't fuck, want... fuck this race. Am I right? Fuck these people in specific. I, I think, I think I'd rather be the guy who comes out of the well every now and then and says. <laughs> no, you just say your line. Say, okay, it's, it's uh. Okay, then here's what we do. Ziggs, Ziggs is Zig, like, Zig, I don't know. I'm gonna, we're gonna put. I'm, I'm, all right, we're gonna put no, no, Zig. No, let me, let me catch. Let me catch him. There's up. gonna be a up. box in the corner of the studio. Zig is gonna stand in it, and it's gonna open up, and we're gonna be like, Zig, say the line. It's just his head. He's wearing like, you know, a genie. He's wearing like a genie turban. All right, Zig, say the line. What? No, 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 this is what, this is what we do. This is what we do. This is what we do, right? No, no, I was hoping you would do the mecha like a high mecha. Oh, mecha like a high mecha like a high home, mo mecha chai mecha mo mecha hey, pickle bear, cotton fly, chimmy cherry. No, 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 like the, no, like the zombie. The fuck who doesn't have that memorized? Like the G. Like the genie from. No, like. Zombie the genie. Like you were. Like, no, I was upset that, like, you were zombie the genie. Mecha like a high mecha high. Hold on, hold on, wait, wait, wait. Here's what we do. Here's what we do. Right? I'm, I'll be the provocateur. I'll say something really bad. Ziggs will be like, Ziggs, Ziggs will be like, I don't know about that one. Or let's dial it down a little bit. Right? He'll be the he'll be the straight man. And then Nick, you say the funny one-liner involving the thing I said. Right? Check, please. Yeah, exactly. We're gonna do a dry run. Right? Everyone ready? Oh God. Everyone ready? This is hell. Sure. Is it all right? <clears throat> 9-11. Yeah! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Nick, say your part. Uh, uh, backing up! Backing up! Oh. Alright, alright. No, wait, 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 I got a better one, I got a better one, I got a better one, wait, 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 wait. Alright, alright, right. take a second, take a second. <laughs> Looks like I took the wrong plane to Albuquerque. Alright, we're good. Wrap it up, we're done with the stream. Oh. We just sell, we just sell that, and we and we become TikTok famous. Oh, can someone girl. clip that whole ass segment, please? Oh God! I put a lot of work into orchestrating that. <laughs> I'll be right back. I gotta be back. But Jesus Christ! <laughs> quick, Qu quick! Everyone, make fun of JT while he's not here. Uh why, why do we keep having pee pants around? <laughs> because he because when he, when he doesn't go, he pees his pants. I still got the pa I still got the paper. I'm just like periodically looking at it by the way. I'm just like You're just like Why does nobody understand me? <laughs> why does nobody in my house understand me? Like, like, I want to be, I want to be like the monkey from like, life could be a dream, life could be a dream, but that never happens, man. <laughs> I just want to like, I just want to swim by a camera. Like, full on, full on like over, over body shot or whatever the frick, just be like, just right by. Or I want to get like a fi I want to get like a fish tank and just like my like lightly tread water on the surface while sticking my face in it and just be like I'm dipsy diving and I was like or whatever the fuck I don't know Kappa Mikey Kappa Mikey was a weird show yeah. <laughs> should oh god yeah no nah, like uh. 
I don't know, like... You know what's funny? You know, like I said, like, it, it is true what they say, like, it is hard to move past from, like, you know, your shit. When people keep, like, reminding you of that shit. Yeah. It's kind of very, it's kind of very, like... And I'm like, God damn it, I keep... I'm stuck in, I'm stuck in limbo. <laughs> I'm stuck in the, I'm stuck in enemy limbo. Dude, I just keep, the robot just keep falling on me. <laughs> never stop. <sighs> Why can't it be happier today? What? A the arrows explode. Wait a minute. Ay, 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 ay. So. What should we call it? Like, one one thing I'm just one thing I'm like annoyingly like pissed off about too right now is like, well not even like annoy not even like annoyingly pissed off. It's just it's just, it's, just, it's, it's like stupid. So we 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 you and I know right, Zig, that Lightyear's a bad movie. Yeah. But there's people who need to spread like stupid shit about the movie. In order to like just be like, yeah, it's bad. Yeah. And it's like, oh, this that the like, look, like Pan, Pan said it best in his video. There's people that say it's like doing this, and it's like, look, the movie's bad on its own. It doesn't need any more like you know, whatever about it. Mm -hmm. And honestly, like the thing that people are complaining about with it is the best thing in the movie. Ah, these arrows keep hitting me! I just keep- I'm in a freaking Ouroboros cycle here! Yeah. We sold it. <laughs> oh god. Fucking hell. That was stupid. The arrows. Oh wait, it's the shy guys. And mech. Oh god. If we actually like if we ever sold out, I think I'd fucking like drop dead. I'd just be like, well, my time has come. Good night. Is that a puppet on strings? Like made a liquid. A <sighs> like the only normal enemies here are the ghosts. <laughs> Lil Boo. Pop box. Poop box. Doppel. Ay 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 ay. But yeah, so. You know what we should. You know what? When JT gets back, Zig, we gotta set him up for the uh, whatchamacallit. Coffee corner. coffee corner. Yeah. Right, let me get that shit. <laughs> I hope he's okay. He's been in the bathroom a while. Yeah, I hope so too. Like, if he ain't, if he ain't feeling up for it, then you know, it, it's whatever. To be quite honest with you, you know what I'm saying? He's got the uh, what you call it. He's got the stress poops. That just sounds like more so like exhaustion if anything. Yeah. Wonder I, I, I wonder what he did. Like I said, I wouldn't mind I wouldn't mind cutting if he if he's just like fucking beat, I wouldn't mind cutting it short though. Yeah. Cause like I like damn. Why is it every time I why is it I feel like every time I try to be funny, it's just like, wow, this sounds depressing, don't it? Yeah, I think it's pretty funny. Well, I come back and two of the party members are dead. Yeah. Well, oh, I'm back and you know. Them. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, you escaped oh. your wrath another day, Mario. Shh, shh. No, baby, he was just he got his phone, this son of a bitch. He's trying to avoid it. <laughs> we'll get that clown. 
<laughs> we'll get him good. <laughs> okay, now this is just starting to get weird. Well, well, it, it's not. I don't think it's as weird as that night. We, like I, I sent uh, JT, and we were posting like all of like the clown car accidents and everything like that. Oh, and, I, yeah. and I sent JT the. Uh, I sent JT like that uh thing with like. I'm back. Well then, JT, do you hear that noise in the wind? It's coming in. I had a story to tell first. Oh, okay, go for it. Go tell your story. Tell your story, and then we'll put you on the chopping block. All right, so. I have come to very much conclusion that my darling baby sister vastly prefers Amanda over me. Oh, why is everything? What the frick? Why is it so depressing? To <laughs> I got. I know, so let me tell you. Let me tell you what she. Let me see the interaction me and my my darling baby sister had. Right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So this is, I think, the day. Amanda went, and uh, stayed last. She went home Sunday, so this was uh, either yesterday or sun or Sunday after she left, right? Mm -hmm. Um, I just helped my dad in the backyard, walking back in the house, and Maggie looks at me and goes, "Oh, hi, JT." I go, "Hey, kid, what's up?" And she goes, "There's not much. Have fun in your room." I'm like, yeah, I will. Thank you. What? And she goes, no, and she goes, I forgot you lived here. Oh. <laughs> and I just, I'm just sitting there like, yep, yes, I do. And I start to walk away. And then I turn back and I go, I'm your brother. <laughs> You're like, you're like, it's a fucking child. But like, I'm her fucking brother. The least she could do is remember I fucking live there. But no, apparently that's fucking what she forgot. Your your Another sister's thing. just like, your sister hath forsaken you, JT. Hundred percent. Another thing that she does, right? Yeah. More proof of this is whenever. Holy shit! Never... Wait, she, she, she pulled a DW on you. Oh, Why God. don't you leave and go back to your own house or whatever the fuck? I live here. Okay. <laughs> but either way, so what happened? What, hap what happens, right? Um. So Amanda, right? Whenever mm -hmm. she comes back from the bathroom. She'll be like, man, Maggie always knows when it's me. Every time I go, she'll be like, hi, Amanda. And I'm like, uh-huh. And, you know, whatever you say. And then I went to the bathroom, right? As I'm yeah. going, I hear Maggie yell, hi, Amanda. And I go, Maggie, it's me. <laughs> oh, no. And I, I go back and I, uh, I relay that to Amanda. And she goes, wait a minute. So she doesn't know when it's. She just always assumes it's me, hoping to be right. <laughs> yes, that is indeed the scenario. And she's just like, "Wow, that's fuck." I'm like, "Yeah, it is." My sister just prefers her over me. It's my life. Are you good, JT? You know? The shit I just took was about a 6 out of 10, so I can't complain about <laughs> <laughs> Alright, fuck it. You know what? I might I might as well... Consider it... So, what, what, right, considering, like, it seems as though you had... You kinda, you know... Don't really have much to talk about with the, uh... Coffee corner. I, I got, um... I got one thing I want to talk about. Well, 
you know? Sounds like you're being a side character, holy I feel like shit. that sometimes, buddy. I'm ne I'm never the host, always the co-host. Either way, um... Where the fuck was I? You're a main Thank character you, to be, JT. Thank you. Well, like, like, or JT, I know, I know we, like, put you, I know, like I said, we keep having to repeat this, because, like, every time you join, it's always, like, the tears of- I don't of, mean for it to happen. I genuinely don't. The tears of a- it's just something fucked up better. <laughs> the clown, the clown has to smile on the outside. I don't know why this has become my, uh, effectively a place where I get to get the vent about how shitty my life can be. I don't mean to do that. I have a therapist I pay. But like... How much do you pay him? You know... Maybe <laughs> not enough. <laughs> do, 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 do you think you get... Do you think you get more out here than at your therapist? You know, I, I would like to hope not. I don't want that to be the case. Don't I have a coffee corner to do? Because that's only well, well, JT, right I, I do know JT. I do know something that uh, you are the host of. Welcome everyone to JT's coffee corner. All right, fuckers. Let me tell you. Let me tell you something that happened. Right. That Here. I found out. At royally pissed. Me. First, I'm gonna tell you about a game, right? Mm hmm. So, I've been on. I, I'm on. Uh, thank you, buddy. I've been on a bit of a phone game, right? I've been playing. I've been playing uh, Arena of Valor, which is a fun MOBA when I'm not playing League. Um, I play Pokemon Unite on, right on my phone. I play. I play a couple of them, right? But there's a new one that came out, I think, I wanna say two months ago, three months. Hello? Called T3 Arena, right? Uh-huh. Or it's a hero shooter on mobile. Okay. Right? Yeah. Um they do they do a couple things that actually make it so that it works pretty fucking good on them. Mm. Cause and they while still having it be a hero shooter like format. One of which being is that you don't have a shoot button. Whenever your crosshairs line up or, or close to lining up, your character will shoot. So you can focus more on just aiming your shots and being in range rather than actually having to like, you know, think about fucking where the fuck is the fire button? Oh God, now I gotta move the camera, all that shit. Something actually pretty well adapted to a phone. And seeing as how we don't have a lot of hero shooters, I'm actually, it's actually a breath of fresh air. Cause it's like, it's got a very, like, comfortable time to kill. A little fast, but not Overwatch fast. But I bring up Overwatch because of one fucking thing that pissed me the hell off. Now, I'm not saying this is fully Overwatch's fault, but I am saying they probably had a good part in it. Uh -huh. So, you know how if you have a video game, in, on YouTube, it'll just assume what tag, like, assume, oh, it's this video game, right? Mm hmm. I guess. And, yeah. like, in the description, it'll be like, more games, uh, more games related to blank, right? Yeah, you know what I mean? Mm hmm. Oh. oh. T3 released a video announcing, you know, their first character they're adding, right? Yeah. And I check the description. Maybe I'll find maybe to find out some more like information, like how to get them, like drop rate, shit like that. And what do I see in the description? What? YouTube called the game fucking Overwatch. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> oh. Now, I, I I'm sure, right? That my deep yeah. hated, my deep rooted hatred. And, and reaction to this 
is very viable, right? But if you mean to tell me that just because it's a fucking hero shooter, that it's fucking Overwatch, I'm gonna fucking kick your ass. Like, I don't want to see another fucking hero shooter get killed because of Overwatch. After, especially after Gigantic. Especially after Gigantic. Fuck, I even, they even killed Battleborn, and I liked Battleborn. Granted, that game had its own problem. All these, I'm gonna be, no, no, you. can I, I'm just gonna be honest here too about the hero shooter genre. Uh -huh. I don't like the term hero shooter genre because it, it feels it was only, it feels it was compounded by Overwatch, if anything, and then everything else is just like, not that it's denote, like, not that it's been like demoted to the status of like the Overwatch clone, but it feels yeah. as though everybody only talks about all the other ones as like, Overwatch clones because of that. Mm -hmm. But like, hero, being a hero shooter is, is, is quite frankly a genre that which more people did. Because it gives you, it, it gives you a lot more of a skill focus and without, uh, and, and you know, care, like player expression mm -hmm. without having to fucking spend the end half your life memorizing combos and item builds of a, of a fucking MOBA. Like, oh, like, so that's why they call it a hero shooter, because it's like, it's like a MOBA, but not really. It's like a, it, it's, it's character based like a MOBA, but instead of it being a, instead of it being like, from that perspective, you're shooting a gun, or swinging an axe, or whatever the fuck, but it's yeah. normally like... It, Overwatch, everybody's prime... characteristics of a, of a MOBA, but infused with a uh, first person shooter and whatnot. Yeah, and, and that to me is a genre that I would love to sink my teeth into. But that, there aren't any. That was my that was like my favorite part about like uh, Gigantic was when I saw the gut when I saw characters actually you doing melee attacks. I was like, wow, that's like that's better than what Overwatch does because like char like characters that have melee attacks have like oh. Ryan, Ryan Hart swings his axe, but it shoots out like a bolt of energy or whatever that hits somebody. Or, you know, the kung fu robot doesn't do kung fu. Hmm. Like, I, I, I... I know, like, Gigantic is a hero shooter, but it has, a, like, a, a, a very healthy amount of melee characters in it, too. So it's almost like a brawler, like, a, a brawler mix. Like you could have a, you could play fucking Beckett, who who had two pistols and a rocket launcher and just and just like harassed you from the sky, or you could play fucking the Cowman, who fucking who had literally an act, <laughs> uh, a, who literally had a fucking spear in one hand, a uh, sword in the other. I think it actually dueled with spears, and he fucking the wrecked cow, shit up. His name is, his actual name is Lord Gnosis, but like he's a Minotaur. Fuck, like, fuck you, he's a Kelman. Like, there was so much cool thing that, that, that the hero shooter genre can do, but there aren't any anymore. Because it all has to follow a singular model, baby. Not even just a singular model. Overwatch did everything to kill all of its competitors. You know, yeah. The only reason why Paladin survived is because it had smite money backing it up. Like... It had smite money? Smite, the, 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 the only other MOBA that's on the market besides League and Dota. Dota? <laughs> like, I don't want an aneurysm to fucking play a MOBA, so I'm not gonna play Dota. So, my option... Boil down. What's, to, what's so bad about Dota? Um, one character has 14 ability. Oh, that it's awful. Yeah. How are they all unique? I don't know. I don't play Dota. I want to find out. JT, your it's life so... is in like existential crisis right now. It seems like. Because I just want, I want a hero shooter. I want to, I want to be able to like. I have mastery of a character that I sunk like time into to understand and, and really get a grasp of. And then I want to like 
take his abilities and I want to ruin them by like fucking with a build or some bullshit like that. Like, yeah. here, like Paladins, for example, right? Mm -hmm. There are some characters that do not belong in the role they're presented. And some characters that work really well in a role outside of it. So like one of the characters, Pip, right? He's a little, he's, he's, he's a little dude. He's got a grenade, he's got like a potion launcher, right? Yeah. Um, he's got one ability that weakens, enem weakens enemies and, uh, and, and stuff like that. One ability that's the potion that heals everyone, every ally in range. And one ability that gives them fucking like hyper movement speed for a couple seconds, right? So obviously, you know, you're meant to play him in the back line, you know, law potions to weaken enemies, shit like that. But some people, myself included, see that kid and go, I can play that at fuckers a fling. Just law potions behind enemies, weaken them to beat them in 1v1, buns and use your movement speed to get the fuck out. And Paladins allows that. Overwatch does. And that's what I fucking hate about it. One of the many things, excuse me. My hatred for Overwatch is unending. I don't, I didn't even mean to let Coffee Corn become I hate Overwatch. Uh, before I go, before I go on that route, I beg <laughs> everyone here, download and try T3. It's an interesting game. The art style is, um, the art style is, is cartoony in a nice way. They don't have a lot of lore yeah. for characters, but they're always kind of interesting, except for like the two Call of Duty men that exist. Do you um, want to know the dark truth about, like, that, though, why YouTube would call it, like, Overwatch or whatever? Because it's a hero shooter, so it's arguably similar. Not just that, but also the fact that, like, the company's working together, you know. If it's um, not a, If it's not associated with... Because, like, Overwatch probably brought YouTube a lot of money. So... You know, the more people do Overwatch or whatever the frick, then... Whatever. Like, it, it, there's no fucking reason that this game can't stand on its own fucking leg. There, there is one. It, it's fucking. It's it's actual like actual dog water that they're not giving the game. Hmm. Because honestly, it deserves it. it. It's a good ass game. Yeah. Like. Oh shit! These guys. There's literally only one thing, only one complaint I have about it. Um. Oh shit. Boy. <laughs> Behold, they've taken the bait. <laughs> I guess I can spare a few minutes. Maybe they'd like to play. That has got to be either the most organic or like energy robot I've ever seen with uh, Domino there. <laughs> God. I wonder if he delivers pizza. Tom and those pizza delivers. Damn it, I'm hungry now. You know, most people don't like them. I want cheesy bread. You know, that's fair. Oh, kill me for it. Most people don't like Domino's. Mm. Well, you got like fair. you got to freaking like you know shill out the bank in order to like buy Domino's pizza. I don't know. I just never thought it was that good. It's not good. It's it it's literally fast food pizza that comes at like a high price for some reason. Yeah. There's much better. But the the cre like you know the scariest thing about Domino's pizza is that like it it literally all of the ingredients are real and shit, but there's got to be like some sort of like dark matter teleporter inside of the ovens at Domino's because that delicious looking pizza goes through that oven. And it's never coming out. You get the pizza from the rot from the garbage dimension instead. I don't fully believe that. 
But for some reason, the cheesy bread turns out okay. Fucking... It's small enough to where it can fit through. It, it, it completely misses the, uh, portal. Though, you know what, the, the sad thing is actually, right? What? Uh, the only time Domino's is better than Pizza Hut. Now that is a- now that is a very base take, no shit. That's a very fucking- that's a very hot take, buddy. No, I actually- I actually do enjoy pizza- I actually enjoy, like, uh, Pizza Hut's personal pizzas. Oh, okay. I don't know why, no. like, the cardboard- the cardboard, like, texture of them is very... nice for some reason. I can get that. But this hold on, hold on. is tougher than... What I thought. You, okay. I don't real, like where this is going. Talk. What's um, up? as a New Yorker, yeah, the best like main big brand of pizza place. Oh right. What's your what's your what's the best like big brand? Put your dukes up. Your oh, desk? I didn't know that. I didn't know that Cloaker and Domino were a part of Cobra here. Holy shit, that's a his tank. <laughs> oh god. But, yeah, like, you like, were saying JT. Okay, best. Hold on, before, before we, we're going on pizza now, so let me just close the top of the corner and then I can ask my question. Holy oh, Coke. 3 Arena. I'm not asking you to give it money. It's a free game. It's a fun game, though. The, gar the, art, the art style is actually really nice. The character designs are, for the most part, pretty fucking unique. Um, hits are fun to fuck around with. Rewards, reward positioning and accuracy. It's a fun game. Try it. It's free on mobile. Oh shit! Look at this. It's actually look at that. It's around the tower in the background. Yeah. Oh, that's sick. I didn't know that. I did. I only noticed that now. I'm like, holy shit. That's neat. Um, but uh, as I was saying for the, for the topic. Um, yeah. Okay. Best. Welcome like, to Pizza big Town, place, baby. Like best, like big, big. Um. Oh shit. There's like big company pizza. Hmm. Big company. Like I'm sure oh. everyone here has like their favorite like local place. I'm talking about like the favorite big company pizza. Yeah. It really has to be Domino's because like I love their fucking cheesy bread and I can't get enough of it. Uh, what about the actual pizza? Though? Oh. Actual pizza. Um, I don't know. I don't really have like. I had like, Little I Caesars never... once, and their pizza was like their pizza was like pretty good. Also, Domino's is like flatbread pizza is actually delicious. Damn it, I'm hungry. Hmm. I get that. I'm um. I'm not, I, again. I really don't like Domino's that much. That being said. Um, I'm a die-hard Papa John's man. Uh -huh. I will live and swear by the Papa. And I am, I am as upset that no one is standing by Mr. John. Have you, have, have either of you ever had CeCe's pizza? Uh, no. Fucking, fucking literal ass dog water. <laughs> it sucks. Literal ass okay. dog water. I, I was... I was lucky enough to, like, you know... Again, we're, 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 we all grew up in New York. You know, we had a fucking... I like CeCe's desserts. CeCe's desserts, those are fine. Those are good. You get, yeah. you can, you can, you can have a seat at my table. But if you if you come to my fucking house, you've had CC's wait, pizza. But wait, G, like JT, you've actually had like CC's, right? Like, yeah. CC's <laughs> had little Caesars. Oh wait, JT, no, I definitely know one you never had though. Go on. So there, there, did you know that there's a knockoff little Caesars called Little Pizzas? I have heard of it. I have not. It's called Little Pizzers. They, they they literally stole almost everything from Little Caesars. Like the guy on the box looks like the guy from Little Caesars, right? Uh -huh. And and he 
you know how you know how like the, the little like talking bubble and it says pizza pizza the to the, the talking bubble for little pizza says piece of pizza See that go to jail <laughs> Do not pass go do not collect two hundred dollars go to jail No no stop talking go to jail You've been you've been at this for too long it is time to help Little pizzas, piece of pizza. Oh uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Like this is the, this is the world we live in now. Yeah. Where we treat, where we treat it like you know, this, that, and the other thing. But yeah, Zig, like you were saying about like growing up in New York with the pizza. I mean, just growing up in New York, like we, we, we. Definitely had like a fucking like you know a lo we get basically had a fucking local like you know pizza chain that we could just like go to and like act actually just like sit down and just like you know have a, like an actual fucking pizza parlor and just you know sit down and have like a, a nice fresh fucking you know pie and everything like that you know what I'm saying yeah it's about like if you there's about like five of them where I am yeah there's a, I can walk three I can walk the two of them. Well, you can go. Well, you can go get carnival food, Jake. Oh, oh boy, shit. guys, hold on, shut up. We got this very special viewer. Wait, uh, wait, 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 wait. Let 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 JT get it, Zig. Let JT get it. He gets uh, one. He I finally one. gets one. Everybody gets one. He finally gets one. How do I, okay, how do I do it? You click on the name. <laughs> Click on it, and what? When we become famous, buy followers, primes, and viewers uh, on... you see the little thing on there that says, uh... Uh, Manage fan. pushes you as a cruiser? What? I don't see that. Oh, there, uh, the report. Do you see the, uh, band with the little, uh, cross? The little, you know, no sign and shit? Oh, I have that a bit hard. Wait, are you in, uh, are you in mod mode? I'm not in mod mode, okay. There's a, there's just, there's a fucking page for like moderators and whatnot. Yeah, I have mod view on. Yeah. I just turned it on, okay. Click. Alright. Oh boy. Well. Stay low V, motherfucker. <laughs> yeah. You got That's one. I did it. He got one. <laughs> you get one. Wow. Like, I, I'm not gonna lie, JT. I honestly feel like a dad who just took his kid out hunting like for the road. <laughs> you shot a deer. No, that was a I'm no. Proud of you. <laughs> he did it. But yeah. All right. How do I go back to regular people view? Uh, I think you just, you just go back and shit. You ban that. Yeah. You ban that sucker. <laughs> hey, Cam, how's it going? Hey, Cam. Uh, it's another bot. I got this one. No, 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 no. Cam's cool. Cam's cool. <laughs> no, I know, I know, I know. Okay. I think I've seen Cam before. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I think I'm gonna kill, like, a Cloaker first. Oh, no. Because, uh, Cloaker, like, seems to be able to, like, insta-gib everybody. Yeah. And he's able to resist the frickin', uh, the shell. <laughs> Take that! You know, actually, you know, speaking of, like, little seasons and little pizzas and everything like that, there was actually this fucking chain out in, like, Indiana or, like, somewhere in the Midwest. Called Noble Romans. Noble <laughs> Romans. Noble, Rom Noble Romans Pizza. Now, and now I'm just imagining one, them delivering the pizza on chariots. Basically, they actually had this mascot that was basically a mix between Sweetums from the Muppet Show and like a, a fucking like you know a Roman soldier and shit like that. So just think of like fucking Sweetums wearing like you know the 
the, you know, like the Roman arm, like the Roman army, like, you know, fucking the Roman soldier, like, uh, outfit and everything like that. Sweetums is the singer, right, from the, uh... No, Sweetums is the big brown, uh, monster dude with, like, the fangs. Oh! So he's, like, uh, gritty. Kind of. I'm here for it. I, I pay, I, I put, I, there's a fucking, I put a fucking thing in the uh, chat if anybody wants to watch like a fucking commercial from the 1980s. Well, you know, you know something though? D did yeah. you know that, did you know that there was a secret, uh, a there was a secret mascot for Domino's Pizza? Are we talking about the fucking Noid? No. Talking about, uh... Oh my god, it is Sweetums! Yeah. Alright, let me see, where is it? It's in chat. <laughs> but I'll send it to you through this for you. If you can't find right. it. Oh my uh, god, that was Sweetums. Holy shit! What, which, which, which channel? Here, yeah, I just sent you a DM. Alright, let's see this. Oh, I don't like him. <laughs> He's he looks like a Mr. Potato Head on fucking speed. He was gonna kill that kid. <laughs> he was gonna kill that kid. <laughs> also, Zig. Yeah. He's gonna kill that other kid. Oh. Phew. What weakling. He's gonna kill those children. How shameful if they, if they were to. Defeat me. Hey, get back here, you son of a bitch. I wasn't done with you. Oh, bitch, I'm gonna give you my spaghetti. Mom, spaghetti. Who's my head? Hey, oh, shit. It's clobbering time. He stole from fucking. Alright, it's time to just fucking, like, max these suckers out right now. Yeah. Go, Mario! Yo! Oh, fuck Alright, we need to heal her up now. I like how the pick me up is like a soft is like a uh, soft drink cup. I actually, you know what? You know what? I I I have a Merrick's coffee corner. I think. All right, hold on, wait, wait. <laughs> Welcome everybody to Merrick's coffee corner. Is it gonna play or? Da, 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 da. God damn it. Well actually not actually not not god damn it, cause um I I, I I spent part of my uh week watching a show that I feel like I was the only person in our group that gave it a chance a little bit. What show? Uh well well in the in the like super immediate group I should say because um Tukin Birdie! I like you Tukin know Birdie. I tried. I watched like half of season one. Hmm. It's a very, it's a very, it's a cute show. All things considered. Yeah. It's it's not bad. It's 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 it had a lot to live up to. Okay, look. Bojack Horseman is my all-time favorite. Mm -hmm. I could I could watch any episode. I could binge the whole series again. I, I, watch I watched show, season one cry. of, like, Tuca and Birdie, like, back when it dropped, and it pissed me off that, like, uh, they canceled it for more Big Mouth. Yeah, no, that, that was tough. Big Mouth is the family guy of Netflix. Let's be... Yeah? Let's be honest here. Yeah. Um, so... Like... My problem, my, my problem with this is that, like, so thankfully it got picked up by Adult Swim. 
And thankfully mm. enough people watched it so that it's getting a season three. Yay! But the point is, is that like I missed out on like what, what bothers me is that like I wanted to watch it, but I wanted to watch it like legally so that, you know, my viewership would count so that it would get a season three. And thankfully I didn't need to do that. But having it appear on HBO Max like months after it was like initially think does not help this whole does not help this like situation of the show and it's like I, I was literally going to say if this shit got canceled for big for big mouth and then it got canceled for low viewership on adult swim i'm gonna fucking like throw something because i i, I really i i really enjoyed it like it, it just has like the right amount of like absurdist humor like yeah, and there are plant titties for some reason. What? There's oh yeah, Dra titties. yeah, Draca. Yeah, I, I don't, I don't, I've never understood Dra it. But there are plant Dra titties. Draca, Draca is the best. Uh, what you call it? Oh god. Blade. Yeah, Draca's best. Uh, Draca's best plant. Anyway. Uh, <laughs> no, like no, she has a very sad moment in an episode where like uh. They get a they get a new landlord and it evicts everybody. Like, oh you can't have pets so you'll be evicted or whatever, and she sadly sends away all of her turtles and like it's very it's very upsetting. So like Well there's not just there's not just Drake, and there's also like a cactus person, his daughter, there's Dapper Dog. Dapper Dog's the best character, by the way, along with Speckle. Uh, mm. But uh, no, and the thing is, like I like by the like I I really I really 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 try to be a speckle a lot, where I'm not afraid I'm not afraid of sharing my like you know thoughts or like you know being myself or whatever. But not like speckle speckle speckle's best boy. Hmm. He's up there. He's up there with like Rousey. He's one of the best boys, dude. You know what? Fair. But, but yeah, no, like, the, the show it's like, the show itself is very cute. It, like, the contrast of personalities is great. It's got, like, serious topics that aren't, like, it's got serious topics that are treated with care. And, like, oh, man, like, the, the, the last, like, season two was, like, a freaking big header. Cool. <laughs> and, and, like, the, like, oh, jeez. It really, like, they really do try to, like, uh, set up this, uh, oh god. They, like, I, I think my only issue with the show is that they really do feel like they're trying to keep the characters in, like, their apartment building no matter what happens, which is fair. They don't want to, like, I guess they don't want to, like, change it up too, too, too much, you know? Right. But, like, just hearing, like, more about the world that it's set in is just cool. Because it's, it... I, I'm, I'm a sucker for when, like, a fictional thing makes up its own holidays and stuff. So, like, you know, Night in the Woods is something like Longest Night or Harfest or whatever. I forgot what they call... I forgot what, like... Cause I think Harfest was only for, like, Possum Springs, what they call it. And this is the point. Because they, they had, like, a Halloween episode, but they called it something else. And they have, like, their own mythology to it with, like, demons and stuff and everything. Yeah. And trick-or-treating is called... Yum or yell. Oh god. <laughs> the freaking fa my favorite part about it is that like if if there was this one in the episode they introduced it like they they get with somebody they get yum and then the next person they do they get a yell and he like he's like oh I hate this holiday <laughs> and it's supposed to be about like you know uh it's supposed to be about like oh. You, you gotta, you gotta pay respect for the dead, or else like they'll come back from the grave or whatever. Yeah, and that, exactly. And that, and that doesn't happen because like they do it seriously. Like the whole time I wanted to like you, when when you were talking about like the cowboy guy, uh, JT for like that one game, it, it reminded me of uh, it reminded me of that episode because like in the show, Speckle lost his luggage to a actual cowboy on a plane. So he, at, at like Tuka's family's house, he gets dressed in it and he, he comes out and he's playing like a cowboy music and he steps in, he does a little hat thing and he's just very embarrassed afterwards because they fucked up his luggage. Mm. And throughout the whole episode, he's getting like this, 
He's literally becoming a cowboy. He's sleeping outside. He's talking with a droll. It's amazing. Like they do, like they do a bunch of like really funny like uh, jokes. It, 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 it's got a got it's got a lot of good like visual humor, good vocal humor, and it's able to pull this all off while being very serious. Man, Two Birdie is a great show. Yeah. And I really hope it gets to live a long time. I will actually be very pissed if it dies. Like, prematurely due to, like... on HBO Max? It's on HBO Max. Yeah, the first two seasons are on it, I think. Unless they still have season one on Netflix. I'll give it a shot. You know, I need more shows to, to watch. Go for yeah. it. I think season two makes a lot more... Like, how... Wait, how far did you get in Tuka and Birdie? Probably about half halfway through season one. It gets, like, it gets really heavy at the end of Season 1, but, like, Season 2, it perks it back up. Like, I, like, I, like, I, I get the whole dynamic of the show, like, by now, it's like... When's it... When's it's like, the challenge... I wouldn't say it's, like, the challenge of having, like, best friends in the scenario or whatever, but it's like... Oh, like... What what is like life like? What is city life like? What is like you know, the stupid shit involving like renting and all this other crap? Yeah, it's very it's very it's very fun, and in a lot of places it's like ve it, its humor is just either like very like weird, or it's like the joke goes to an unexpected turn. Like, they summon a ghost, and she acts like, Oh, I was alive! Wait! I, I'm dr I was driving when you put when you summoned me here, or whatever. And everybody's, like, freaking out, because they think they might have just killed a shit ton more people. Oh, God. It's a good show. Like, I, like, I can't, like... <laughs> it's, really, it's really good, really cute. I love it. Oh, my God, I lived. Die, die, die with the star in. So yeah, uh, what, wait, what were you saying about like Bojack Horseman, JT? I I expected to get Bojack Horseman out of that show, and I didn't immediately. I, I and that's why I was like, that's what was kind of turned off from it. I think I liked. I'm gonna be honest with you, JT. I think I liked it more than Bojack Horseman. That's a bold claim. It's because, like, alright, like, Bojack Horseman, I felt, was very... Uh, man. How do I, how do I put this? Bojack Horseman was very heavy, and it's not afraid of that, which is good. But... Like... You know, like, you, you know... You don't always want heavy. Yeah, like, I need, I need some freaking levities with... But... Wow. That, that, he did not last a second! Well, oh, he's got a literal one-tap. Oh. But yeah, like I, I, like I said, I, I need some, I need some levity to my, like, you know. And I don't think Bo, I, I, I honestly didn't think that Bojack was able to, like, you know, pull off that levity well. Because, like, a lot of it is very heavy, you know? So. Yeah. Like I, I, like I said, I love completely fucking like off the wall weird ass humor. Look, we were watching fucking Freddy got fingered before the stream, for God's sake. So, it's there like, it. there you go. Like that, like, I don't want to say like, I don't want to say like, oh, like Toucan Birdie is like, is literally just like Freddy got fingered, but like, you know, whatever. But nah. It, so here's the thing, I completely get that and respect it. I'm someone who likes media that me anything that makes me feel shitty. I, I wanna I wanna like I will I will gladly feel pain anything a show wants to put me I through. killed Cloaker but I didn't kill the snake. Mm. Well you're almost done. Oh my god, and then after this we got like about five more boss fights. Yeah. Didn't we go through like two of them this ep this episode? Yeah. I'm technically stream, but you know. This episode of the stream. Oh. <laughs> Everyone I know is dead. 
Oh god. But yeah, no. And there goes Mallow. Oh, come on, Gino Blast, do the trick. I feel like I should revive Mallow, but I don't want to waste a Star Storm. Gino, come on, man. Kill it, kill it, please. Please, die. Die, Snake, die. Yo, Joe. Finally! Joe finally did it! <laughs> they did have to do the G.I. Joe thing in order to beat the stupid snake. Good. <laughs> Fuck. But, but yeah, you want, you want to see like media that makes you feel like shit. I like things that make me feel terrible. I don't know why. Like... It just, make, it just makes you stories. reflect just makes you reflect on your life choices and decisions and it tears you up on the inside, you know? Yeah, no, I want something that makes me, that makes me fucking look back at myself and I was like, you know what? Suicide might have been the option. Oh. Whoa! Nah, I'm joking. I'm joking. Whoa! I'm, I'm Whoa, joking. man, do you want to talk or something like after no, the stream? No, okay, okay. Let me, let me, let me... I, I, I am okay. I'm actually in a. In oh like shit! A uh, I was making I was making a, a jokey example. Yeah. I like media that makes me feel depressed. I want to be challenged with heavy topics and, and shit like that. Some like that's e the shit I look e for. Depression. Like, I am okay with there not being a happy end. I just don't want to be surprised with them not with there not being one. You know what I mean? Uh, I guess. I guess I'm thinking that I like heavy, and that's why I love BoJack Horseman. Oh. It just left me in fucking shock and awe throughout like just about every episode. I, I like the I like the ending theme of BoJack Horseman. Back oh, yeah. in the '90s, it's such a good song. Especially, oh, when they, especially when they play it on a pipe organ. Um. Fucking Christ. I remember. Um. And I had a class where I had to do, like, pre like oral presentation. Right? Yeah. And I basically got to pick, when, you know, whatever the hell I wanted. And there were three, pre there were three assignments. Mm -hmm. Effectively, um. One of them was. Something from a book or a comic book. One of them was, uh, I think it was a poem, and then one of them was a monologue from a show. So I chose um, the one, my favorite episode of BoJack Horseman, which is just a 30-minute or a 15 to 20-minute monologue. Obviously, I had to shorten it a fuck ton. But like, I fucking performed part of it in class, and I was like, oh, this is this is the fucking best. I fucking Ah, I owe a good chunk of my mental mental health to that show. It definitely helped me realize when I was younger, oh, I really am depressed, huh? Well, shit, I should do something about it. Anyway, this guy's talking. You want to voice him, JT? Yeah, sure. Yeah, production is on schedule. And this... Despite the fact that Mac Boyo, Yadovich, and the Axum Rangers were defeated. At this rate, Smithy will have a new army in no time. A new army? Yeah, new army. I, army. He, I just told him he could wish for it, but you know, I guess the Star Road's broken. You can't be making more weapons. Haven't you caused enough trouble already? Oh, 
Oh yeah? Who are you? This guy looks like he's related to Boomer. Yeah, that tracks. This is the Mario. Give up now while you still have a chance. Shut down production now, or he'll stomp ya. Oh, mamma mia! What did you say, you little puffball? Bad mallet. Thrash out. By the way, he is another one of the bosses. Oh, okay. <laughs> that, like, you fight a boss, and then immediately afterwards, you encounter another boss. <laughs> That, but he, he's only one of like the collective bosses that make up this area because then there's the there's the clerk the foreman the uh, oh God, what was the other one? Clerk foreman then I think there was also uh, Oh, what's another factory thing? Clerk foreman and then the clerk foreman and then the manager Oh, okay. Yeah, and then after, and then I think the manager or the foreman fights you with like the uh, what should we call it? With like the gungu or whatever. And then after you defeat all of them, then you fight Smithy. Like this is like the final run up, by the way. Oh, sure. All right, let's see what you got. Oh man, he's huge. Come on, put him up, put him up. How about this? Star stop! Uh. <laughs> Take this! Star stop! I'd like to imagine, like, the star is, like, giant ass cheeks or something. That's what's hitting him. Fucking twerking on this fucking poor man. Twerk on the fucking haters. I'm surprised those mallets survived. M Molo, did you just summon a star with ass cheeks? Uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> why do you need Star Road? Can't you just wish on those? Listen, you don't want to know what happened the last time we tried this. <laughs> we tried to wish on them stars. You know, you know what? Uh, you know what? Normally, I'd like to press on this one. Right yeah, now. The term all kicked up. Oh, oh God. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, I'm so sorry. Yahoo! <laughs> ha! Hope you learned your lesson, bitch. Better, uh, better wish you don't get soap in your mouth for that one. We're almost there, Mario. Come on! You see how brave Mallow became? Well, he found his parents basically, uh, actively trying to fuck someone else in front of him. <laughs> what do you suppose this switch does? Hmm. Oh. Oh, mamma mia! Hey, Green, how's it going? Huh? What's with the funny face, Mario? Oh, you're trying to make me look, aren't you? I'm not gonna fall for that one. Molo, I have a wish. I wish you're. I wish you weren't such a fucking idiot. Look up. Ah, help me, Mario. Boy, that was scary. I guess green switch 
controls the pain. Hmm. Oh wow, I can't. Or I thought you were able to jump on that. On that. Here. Oh shit. Oh JT. <sighs> Hold on. I have info <clears throat> about the specs of the PC in the giveaway I entered. Mario. <sighs> Yes, that's it. Oh, God. Hey, job, and let's both Mario and the princess worthwhile. You're going to help both of us? I could. Now, what could you use? He's gonna make us buy it, ain't he? <laughs> what you buying, stranger? <laughs> what are you buying? <laughs> what are you buying? Oh, God. Damn it, Toad! Hmm. Hope he didn't buy anything from me first! Try and catch yeah. me. Try and catch me, bitch! Catch me if you can, motherfucker! There is some of the specs of the PC probably won't win from the giveaway. Hmm. Thank you, Toad. Ah, oh. We're almost there. Come on, let's show them. Ooh. 32 gigs. There's your gigs of RAM and RTX 3090. Okay. I'm cool. gonna sell some cool. shit. Oh, you carried a lot here, Tone. I hope, uh, I'll be mind carrying some more back. Lucky Jewel. I accidentally sold the pick me up. Stop selling stuff! Oh, God. I'm gonna buy back all those pick me ups. How about the lucky jewel? I didn't need that. I was trying to sell that, actually. I didn't want to get rid of the shiny stone or whatever. Because they're not gonna be. Because the shiny stone lets us access uh, Qlex. Really? 
the final save point is all the way back up here. At least with all of like those guys, huh? Mm-hmm. Seems like it. So definitely an upgrade. It is an up. Ah! Are, we gonna, are we gonna are we gonna call it here? I guess. Cause I know I know Zig's gotta like hop off. Yeah. Yeah. Hold on, I'll, I'll kill Yuridovich here, and then we'll... Alright, Nick, what did we learn? Um, I don't know. Uh... Every, everybody... Know everybody has DD depression. Oh. No. I don't want to go on on that. <laughs> nah, what's the positives here? We've learned that your dad has made the, the biggest fucking schizo post of his life. Oh, Maybe. he's made a ton more. Well, this one takes the cake. At least for me. We, um, we learned that you can't pull one over a dog, doctor. <laughs> what? Remember the jokes we told at the beginning of the... Of the oh, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Pocket sand. Ow. I learned that pocket sand hurts my eyes. I learned that I learned that when when in doubt, just just shove a ton of bosses in the final act of your game and then like, you know, work on it from there. I feel like this well, game I feel like this game wanted to be like way longer or something. You know, it might, I don't know. Well, I mean, we did start, we did start this way before I actually, like, moved out, moved out of my fucking house and shit. Yeah, this was, like, before the, like, I, I have a feeling that this game wouldn't, I have a feeling that this game wouldn't be as, like, Yik would have been a way longer game to play. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, hang on, that's because of... You also gotta factor in difficulty and all that. Yeah. Because Yik was a bitch of a game to play. Sure. Well, this, well, this, it's like, but this can be difficult too. It's just that it's like, some, somehow, I, somehow, I kind of managed to like mash my way through several like fights or whatever. Mm -hmm. That's a um, pretty good PC. Cool. Yeah, uh, I'm not. Like the hard, hard drive, I. I I have like a fucking two terabyte hard drive in my thing and shit like that, but even then, 500 gigs is not that bad. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah I, long, I, I can kill for 500 have, gigs. Um, if you have like an external like one terabyte, to, uh, you're good. Yeah. I'd kill for like 500 gigs in my freaking thing, <laughs> but that's not yeah, gonna dude. that's not gonna happen. <laughs> oh God. Well, you know, I think we learned that also computers are pretty damn powerful and cool when they want when they want to be and need to be. Yeah. Oh, we agree. Um, oh, that actually reminds me. I have, a, I have another joke to tell. Merrick, you'll like right. this one. Uh, there's one more joke for the night, and then that's it. All right. It's a short yeah. one. It's a short one. <clears throat> a horse walks into the bar. The bartender asks, why the long face? The horse says, my crippling glue addiction is slowly killing my family. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was terrible. Ay, ay, ay. Thank you, good night, Abby. Take, make sure you tip your waitresses. So anyway, guys, thank you guys for joining us tonight. I hope you guys enjoyed. And remember, as always, be yourselves and remember, <gasps> Make a like a hi, make a hi ho. Mo, make a chai, make a mo, make a hey. Wait, can I give a link to the giveaway? Let me know if anybody wants to just message me, and I'll message it. So you can post it in the you can post it in the chat of uh, Discord. Great. Yeah, you can post yeah. it in the Discord chat. Just just give context for the link so that people know like what it is, you know. Yeah. Just just don't leave like an ominous link and be like, do -do 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 -do, and expect everybody to get it because I don't know. There's apparently scams going around, so keep your eyes open for that. Yeah. So it was like. Anyway, guys, thank you guys for joining us tonight. I hope you guys enjoyed. And remember, as always, be yourselves and remember, 
Make a leg of high, make a hidey ho. Mo, make a chai, make a mo, make a hey. Pickle bro, come quat, chimichurri changa. That's a secret word of the day. All right, guys, catch you all later. Merrick out. See you guys. Good night, everybody. Bye-bye.